So guys, our Nigerian pastor no they disappoint us when it comes to their prophecy in our Christendom. I want you to watch this video. We go come back. Watch the video. Bring down the I will save him. Before that oil finally born, I see fire coming in that oil kingdom. Please, I'm praying for it. Tell go I said. I'm telling you, that's all. I saw where they are born in that, uh, uh, that oil you catch fire, that place. I saw fire on that dango tape or you something. I have seen it. I want to keep quiet. I say, if they say now, I said I'm prophesying. But the, I, I don't know when God push it out for me because there's uh, so many things I want to keep quiet until God finish with Nigeria. I don't want to talk. And anything I'm talking about is make sure that they release him now the car, the only true man in this country. Then they release that guy. That's all. Wow. One man that's. I'm, I'm, I'm worried. Welcome back, guys. Now, in as much I don't like to talk about Nigeria, Pastor, there is no how we're not going to talk about this thing because it affects our society. That man that you just watched his video there, his name is Odu Meje, and he's a pastor in the eastern part of Nigeria. And this man, you know, he has been uh, the kind of man we be saying the trend for social media. If you hear Ida Boski Kaba, now be the man we be the talk i think this man needs some orientation he needs somebody to let him know that dangote that is talking about that dangote should come to his church that dangote is not a christian is a muslim well uh, i think you if you don't know what is really talking about dangote built a refinery in nigeria uh to be precise, Lekki Peninsula and this Dangote and this refinery is one of the biggest so far refinery in Africa. It's even the largest refinery in Nigeria for many years now. Nigeria have been yearning to have a better refinery so that they can be able to have their own being refined in Nigeria so that they will not be exporting their crude oil to abroad. So since then we ne government never do anything better but we saw this man that we believe that government you know uh, with the help of the government he became a refinery owner and see waiting our pastors now don't they see to this man say the refinery way go benefit the whole nigeria and that refinery go catch fire soon say the refinery go catch fire made them bring down gote to in church so that it go help down gote so that the refinery no go catch fire. You see, this our our pastors sometimes they make all the Christians look uh, stupid when it comes to the way they give their prophecy, the way they believe the prophecy is supposed to be carried on. Because a refinery of like Dango, a very big refinery, a refinery of a capacity of 650,000 barrel per day. Are you telling me that that refinery will not be insured even if there is a fire incident that the Dangote will lose totally on that refinery? If there is any fire incident, it will also pay Dangote more because I believe that that Dangote refinery should be insured in one of the top highest insurance company in the whole world because it's a large investment you don't expect that kind of an investment to only be insured or not to be insured or to be insured with small companies that dangote will never see his money back so when it's even got fire rest your mind pastor that is not an avenue for you to scare Dangote because Dangote is not somebody like you that will be running enter scatter to make sure say he can't see you because say you give a prophecy. When I know they see prophecy, we go help Nigeria citizens. When I know go see prophecy, we be see Nigeria go wake up early in the morning and just laugh, say oh God, thank you. But the one we go they give heart attack, heart breaking now when they see. Since we don't the suffer refinery, none of na come out, come tell us, say, wow, something like this, so then go take go build that. But now you don't build that now, now to cash fire, now be the prophecy we will not see. Where a lot of people with their own uh, views and opinion. So, my beautiful people, I go to come out to you to share people's comments on this uh, video. You know, people, they like to share their own views when it comes to things like this. So I go to read one or two comments for you to see uh, what people are really reacting on this issue. This one is coming from Aye Gushi. He said, Refinery, we never start to the work. Una don't they see una useless vision on top, um, 
you guys are part of the country problem. Very rubbish prophecy. prophecy. Una know they see better thing for una life. That one is coming from Aye Gusi there. Truly, if you look at Nigerian pastors, sometimes una know they see better thing. Is it every time we go, they see bad, 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 bad thing for our country? You guys are even part of the problem of the land. Another one coming from a berry here, Empire. He said, Nigeria pastor hardly see positive visions, prophecies, now so so bad news than they see. Now, why then they cause problem in some family with their fake visions? You see, a lot of people don't lose their family. A lot of people don't even lose their road when it comes to this prophecy. This is why sometimes I don't like going to prophecies, church, because sometimes the way all these pastors are always cooking their prophecy, you yourself, you will know that what they are saying is not true. In the clause of faith, 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 you will be convincing yourself. You will be fighting your spirit to make sure that you go into their path that what they are saying is true. That is brainwash. Another one is coming from Will Reason. He said, religion is the problem of Nigeria. The first good thing in the, in over 60 years and they have started seeing nothing. So that God they should come and see you. Is he one of the brainwashed disciples? I think that Voshe will never dare to do that. Dangote will never dare to do that to come to you because the guy even a Muslim and he even see more than you. You think all these Dangote of a thing, they believe in your prophecy. They believe in their IQ, hard working power of money and the strength of connections that is what they use though, and that is what you your pastor, you yourself you are looking for you want to connect so they also have the connections for them to use so if you believe all this your prophecy will bring that good day to you my brother you are just joking it will never work that will it will never work you will be looking at your video and just be laughing like see this guy is trying to make ends meet that's what that we will just be saying another one is coming from dt silver he said they are buying christians in play two states burning down their houses and rendering them homeless he didn't see that one he did not see solutions to the horror now refinery way then in short he they see <laughs> see you can see what i'm really talking about you know a lot of things that really happen in nigeria that needs to be talked about that people just need to know much about the in Plato's now the christians that you said you are governed on that you are a leader of them they are buying them in Plato's. You your prophecy never go that route but then go to we don't already finish in no refinery now your prophecy they go in no route now this company will be said they're insured even if i have born in, in case these guys don't know how insurance companies works do you understand when you insure something you feel like make the something even damage so that you can get new one because the insurance you don't already pay for them you they pay for them every month or yearly so if anything damage happen to the insurance and the insurance company then go come fix them for you so rest your medal do make if the refinery burn then go come repair them for dangote so rest your mind baba so we have another comment coming from dear it jp he said the a real man of god will see it coming and pray about it some of them won't say it at all this man they find better money i pray make dangote act like whiskey for this matter <laughs> so guys if you don't know how whiskey always hurt on this comment that this guy is saying whiskey is kind of person when you say something about him he doesn't even care about you he doesn't even reason you understand so that's whiskey for you when it comes to something like this so this guy is saying that he wish Dan Gote can even keep quiet and not even talking about this issue at all. I trust Dan Gote will just be laughing. He won't even see what the man is even saying. So we have another comment coming from Dennis Ogumaike. He said, you are you are right in Daboski. I also saw fire on the refinery. It's called gas flay, indicating the commencement of the operation at the Dangote refinery. 
truly maybe that is what uh, in Daboski saw when it comes to refinery there will be fire on top the building on top on top on top to show say this refinery oh, in go soon commence work maybe not the fire na in Daboski they see we ain't talks in a prophecy na in see so a lot of things really uh, really happen in Nigeria when it comes to prophecy like this so those of you who are waiting to see fire in Dangote refinery, I think you just gonna wait, 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 wait to the end. Nothing will happen. And if it happens, the insurance are there to take care of that. So another quick update. Our pastor, our daddy in the Lord, Pastor David Ibiomi, don't come out with another thing. No, we go shock the lies you. Watch the video, guys. So church is when people drum, they pay them for beating drum. I say you're beating drum, they pay you. That's why you never be if you are hearing me anywhere in the world. And they pay you for rendering service. I can tell you, will never come out of poverty. Thou shalt serve the Lord your God. He shall bless your bread and water. So the moment you serve God and they pay you, the blessing stops. And the blessing of the Lord make it rich. So you just remain at the level they are paying you. You will never rise. As you see, drummers will see money, never get rich. Welcome back, guys. Now you don't watch our pastor. You see, if they are paying you when you are workers and you are working for God in the church or you are a drummer, you are drumming for God in the church, but they are paying you for it that you will never and never come out of poverty because they are paying you on that. You see, this there is something in Nigeria that we fail to ask. If they are not paying you for working for God, should they pay you for working for Satan? Because I I I when I look at the way people reason sometimes, I look at it for what kind of mentality do we even have as a Christian? You said if somebody is being paid for working for God, he will never come out of poverty. Should people be paid for working for Satan? Which one is even better? Is it for paid for working for Satan or paid for working for God? Because we all know that we need this money to live life, even God knows that we need money to live life. Now you are working for God and you are not being paid. When you work for Satan, you are being paid. Which one will you think that people will rush? Is it for God that is only for charity or for the Satan? We will give you food, put food on the table. Do you understand? Now they don't want people to talk much about being get paid in the church. We have offerings, we have uh, um, tithes, we have a lot of money being paid to the church for the development of this church. When we're talking about the development of the church, management, financial management, and all these things are involved in which you have to let them know that, okay, this money is coming in and this is how it's go out money is keeping coming in only pastor will be spending the money to even pay to even pay the workers who are working for you in that church you count it as against god rules but when the money comes you can take it and buy car for yourself you can take it and buy private jet for yourself you can take it and enjoy life send your kids to universities and abroad build a big companies enjoy your life with your family but to pay those people who are working for the god is also against the rules of lord well i don't just want to talk much do you see when you say you should be talking about nigerian and the way our christians have been run in nigeria you will talk 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 you go explain tire because say even the deaf they hear even the blind, they see, see, waiting then they preach, no be the right thing we supposed to they happen in our environment. So, my beautiful people, I just make I bring you this a quick update, Chapali, as they saw for my table for you. Don't forget to give your comments in the comment section below and also share this video to other people how there. It's your boy personally. Hola of my media tv if you are coming across this video for the first time this is what we do on our channels we review things like this and explain issues that are really on trending issues don't forget to subscribe and also follow us on this platform may god bless you as you do so see you in another video peace out